Hello everyone. The death of Inbox by Gmail is a particularly hard one to swallow for fans of Google's alternative email service. It's easy to understand the frustration, as Inbox offered a variety of unique features. So what are your options if you're coming from the shuttered email app? We've got you covered with a look at the best Google Inbox alternatives on Android. The first alternative is Gmail. The Gmail team has been hard at work porting features from the alternative client to their own app. These features include snoozing, nudges, and smart compose. Unfortunately, we still have to wait for the likes of email bundling and pinning. It's a great alternative nonetheless, but we just hope Google brings the missing features sooner rather than later. Next is, Newton Mail. It was a big surprise when Newton Email was resurrected earlier this year, as new parent company Essential shut the app down in 2018. Thankfully, the subscription-based service is back, and you're getting plenty of bang for your buck. Prominent Newton features include read receipts, email scheduling, undo send, snoozing, a metric ton of app integrations, and recap functionality. Third is, BlackBerry Hub plus Inbox. The BlackBerry Hub isn't the first inbox replacement one normally thinks of, but the company's unified email and social media inbox has loads of features. From priority inbox support and snoozing to customizable swipe actions and grouped emails, the BlackBerry Hub can certainly hold its own. Next is, Spark, email app by Riddle. The newest Android entry on the list, Spark first made its name on iOS and Mac. The email app stands out thanks to priority email functionality, pinned messages, reminders, scheduling, snoozing, email delegation, and customizable swipes. It's free too, so you've got nothing to lose by trying it out. Last but not the least is, Blue Mail. One of the more popular third-party email apps around, Blue Mail offers a slick design and plenty of features. The app offers quiet hours, snoozing, smart cluster organization, and a dark mode. Now, if only the dark mode was OLED friendly. That's it all. Help you guys enjoy the video. Like share and subscribe to support our channel.